Good morning. Well, it's not even morning. I uh, woke up pretty early today. Where's my hat? Got my head shaved yesterday. I don't know where my hat is. Uh, what I have to pop a do with? Can't find the old one. All right. There we go. Just pop a new one real quick. All right, perfect. Got a hat. Kitchen is a wreck. My kitchen just becomes a wreck quickly. It just happens. So I gotta clean the kitchen. Stand on a medicine ball. And then I got to wait on Ernie to get here because we're taking Omar to the vet today. I don't think there's any shoes coming in today. I don't think anything has actually gotten here. As some of you in the comments are very annoyed because you only started watching this channel for unboxing. So if you only watch this channel for unboxing, what you should probably do is unsubscribe and go watch one of the 5,000 other channels of people unboxing shit. This is a vlog. I'm gonna do what I want. I just happened to buy a lot of shoes and talk about them. I'm not gonna start having my day be based around shit that I don't want to be based around. If you don't like it, you don't gotta watch. Uh, view count doesn't matter to me, or I would be buying every hype bullshit release and telling you that it's fire. Um, so, yeah, I'm only really trying to get the people that fuck with me in one place. If you don't fuck with me, you can fuck off. That simple. Love you to death. Let's get the day started. First, gotta smoke some green crack. Gotta put the colors on the shelf. <laughs> so, Omar. It's kinda coming together. I just put whatever I wear on the shelf. Still haven't built those. Still shit everywhere. But, uh, I'll get to it. I've just been busy, you know? Busy, busy, busy. Oh. Hey, uh, what time are you gonna be here? I was thinking like two-ish. Uh, fuck. Just got word from one of my in-stores that they just got an EQT before release date, so we're gonna go grab that today. Look at that blessing that just was rained down upon us. For all of you waiting for an on feet, you're gonna get one. But I gotta decide what to wear today, so. And I don't know what to wear. I'm wearing all black, per usual, so. This is the struggle, I really. Ever since the collection video, I honestly don't know what the fuck to wear. Ever. I think he's gonna wear nice kicks today. Yeah, nice kicks. I got two different colored socks. And I don't kick at all. Nice kicks. Nice kicks. Omar! Yo, chill, bro. Mm. Good man. Okay. We gotta go to the doctor. We're gonna take you to the doctor. Good boy. Oh, hold up. Omar, we up. Cherry Creek Shopping Center. Yeah. It's 10 minutes. Yeah, I know. <laughs> but we have to be at that <coughs> vet by 2.45. Yeah. We have an hour to run over there. Yeah, we're doing good. Run in. I'm not even gonna take the camera into the mall because I'm just gonna grab the shoes. Whoa. Oh. Don't I kill the dog. Ladies. She's not <laughs> crossing, I don't think. No? Yeah. Well, maybe she's not. She's a blazing hottie. Yeah. She's a blazing hottie in the building. Nice. Blazing hottie in the building. She loves Omar. I just had to blow her off. I was like, sorry, we're late. We gotta go. Nice. Yeah, I gotta keep her. I gotta keep her she wanting more. Bay. Damn, I only got a glimpse of him. That man is busy. Always coming and going. Yo. Omar, what you doing? Shit. Fuck out of here. Fuck out of here. I don't move if it ain't boosted. No. I got boost, you ain't gonna see me in the roosts. What are you doing? Why are you trying to get up here? He's like a fucking animal. You're trying to crawl your way through. Omar, you cannot fit. <laughs> this dog. You can't fit. That's not gonna work. Baby. It's He's not, trying to jump, his back feet keep coming off. It's not gonna work. Not gonna fit oh yeah. Jesus fucking Christ. He's like shaking. He's just like, yo, I'm, I'm sick of y'all having the car vlogs yeah. without me. Oh, red light. I cannot believe you just climbed up 
and through that little hole. Dude, that grape ape is the truth. Yeah, the blueberry is fucking weak. It's kind of weak. Dude, it's not kind of weak. It's like smoking fucking oregano. Yeah, so it's not even it's weak. Tasty. No. Yeah, exactly. It's like oregano. Pure Avita or whatever that weird one that was covered in crystals. That shit rocks you. It almost. I got me. gypped. I got gypped on the re up. No. I no. told you my shit came in. Yeah, the but card. you didn't give me a password. Well, I got the password. <laughs> Come on here, baby. It's a black and white EQTs. <laughs> like, you're trying to figure it out. Like, we're not going to go get them real quick. Yeah, that's all there is to it. Hey, and if we get to the doctors early, we might get in early. Just like yesterday. Just like yesterday. I gotta see this, The Wire. The Wire is amazing. I've heard a lot of people say it's one of the best series ever. That's the best show that's ever been made. That yeah, that dude stops, man. Oh. That's a restaurant. I know, but Bed Bath. No. Oh, shit. Jesus Christ. Here we are again. We get this ticket. There it is. We're just going right back out. We'll let this lady go. Go ahead. We're just turning right around. God. So close, though. All right. We're going to find it, buddy. Oh, he laid down for you. Oh, yeah. I know. I wish I had cookies. Because we'll be there at 228. Yeah. So if we account for the 12 U-turns you're gonna take. They're not supposed to be out for another 20 days. Your mesh. I'm pretty sure it has a mesh inline, but oh. I copped it anyway because we came all the way out here. Look, is your homie. You don't really know him. Y'all are dogs. Oh. Yo, oh. you see him now. Hey. Oh, you mugging, fam? What's up, what's good? What's good, you don't want no smoke? Yeah. Okay, cheese. You can cheese. Oh. Oh, Omar's new, right? Yes. Okay. Yeah. 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 He's got like pictures. Oh, that looks a lot awesome. like baby. Hey, how are you doing? Hey, how are you? Been good? Huh? Uh, no, somewhat. Trouble? Yeah, he's in a little bit of trouble. <laughs> A lot of bulldogs, their their eyes are kind of a little bit, their eye openings are a little bit longer. Okay. His are nice and round. Okay. And I love to see that. It tells me that he's they can be healthy. And usually, when they're nice and round and healthy like this, rarely do we have problems. Oh. God. It's like a legit check. <laughs> yeah. Oh God, I love his frame. Yeah, he's uh, he's really well balanced. That's a nice looking puppy. Thank you. Do you get him locally? Florida. I had someone just drive him out for him. God. I'm so glad his tail doesn't corkscrew in. He's got it. Last, I love seeing a, a torn oh my, tail. My last one that I used to bring you, he passed away this year, and his just, I mean, it was just awful. Usually when we can see this, there's strong back here, nice okay. strong hips and everything. That uh, No, he's got a really, really, really nice, nice build. He's got a good slope here. He's not straight up and down. Right. Still a little pinched here, but he seems to be real comfortable breathing through his nose. Yeah, yeah. So I don't think that that's an issue. And as he grows, that might open up a little bit nice. more. But uh, but we'll we'll watch him. Good. Oh, no! Oh, thank you. Look at that face! Oh my God! You are so cute. Wait. Have a wait. Oh my God! This most patient the puppy's ever been. <laughs> Waiting for a treat. <laughs> Says we're not dating. Everyone thinks that we're together. <laughs> Think about like normal life, like normal life. Most like, people dudes, don't have their. Most people don't like, like roll around right. with their boy all day, you know. Yeah. So like I mean, people in the comments call us gay all the time. It's amazing. Yeah. It's the they same call as us gay, but they would never leave us alone with their girlfriends. Yeah, that's right. Yeah. I mean, I have. I mean, I have a girlfriend, so but you could leave me alone with your girlfriend, but still, <laughs> not Teddy. I won't leave Teddy alone with my girlfriend. Yeah, oh, damn, Disney has pulled all of its content from Netflix. Why? It's gonna start its own streaming service. Damn, they're doing the fucking title Apple shit with movies now. He just went like this, and like a bunch of 20s fell in his mouth. I wish you had that on. I, I was like, God damn it. Thinking about it. There he goes. 
Shirt. Omar slobber is real today. Today. Perrier. One of the black and white. Others are just calling it textile. I've seen. I've seen embroidered. I've seen all kinds of shit. So. Anyway, whatever. I don't know that exact official name. This is the. Let's just call it the EQT Support 9317 textile. They didn't print anything on the box, so and they got room. Put out early. These actually don't release until. I don't know when. It's like the 24th, I feel like, or something like that. I knew that the upper was mesh and I didn't care at the time. I just want, because I wanted to see how flexy it was. You know, like the Alexander Wangs are mesh and I like those. And um, a couple of other mesh shoes I've gotten, I actually like the NMDs that I didn't like. And honestly, I've only put on two mesh NMDs in my life. So I may have been missing out on some stuff. I don't really know. Um, I can tell you that the mesh, the mesh situation is not the same to me in this shoe as it is in the NMDs I've tried. I, I don't know if it's because the NMDs is looser and it slips around a little bit more. I mean, PK upper on an NMD is just really comfortable. That's all there is to it. The PK upper on these, which they weren't even calling PK, right? People argue with me, they're calling it glitch knit. So maybe that's a little bit thicker, I don't know, um, than regular PK. And that's why you don't feel as much of a difference because honestly, putting these on wasn't even that bad. Hold on, I'm gonna go grab a PK pair or a GK pair. Let's test this out because it's been a while, I guess. I'm gonna leave it. Not much difference. Like it doesn't feel that much different. So the PK may be a little softer. It's it's a little softer. And the materials on the PK are just, you know, obviously it's just different. So but it's really not that bad. And I guess maybe because mostly this, I mean this is all mesh up here. It's only really PK in the toe area that's stitched on like a panel. It's really just one little panel of PK, which has same thing with this, it's just like the panel isn't isn't primed it. And there is like it's a mesh inline, like right. <laughs> I can't see. Yeah, it's like a mesh inline, but it's not the same as the NMD. It is mesh, but it does not feel the same. That's all I really gotta say. It's not slippery. That's what it always feels like slippery inside the NMD. But these are a little lighter in the leather patch, really, where they, you know, they did the different, they did the embroidering or the textiling here on this one. No real leather on this. Um, so there's no real like high-end materials and uh, that's that's a big change. But so all black upper, super black, no pepper. That is the white stitching that goes from heel to where the toe starts. And then on the other side repeats, the other side of this. Normally looks like that, just so you know, there is a difference. It's one of the big striking features of the new shoe, I think, is just the stitching looks really clean. The black and white colorway looks really clean. This transparent heel cup is really, really cool. I guess that's a heel case. This transparent heel case, I think, is really cool. Kind of see the stitching even through it, which is pretty sick. All black laces, EQT Dubre, and then um, you have the what do they call that thing? Aren't those things called something? The ortholite insoles on these. Insoles are kind of removable. They're not, doesn't look like they're meant to be removable, but you can take it out if you want to. It's not, you know, there's room to take it out. It is glued down, so if you take it out, you take it out. Black three stripes made up by the lace ribbons, which is cool. Probably my favorite part about EQTs, as well as the burrito tongue. I always like to wear my EQTs basically just super unlaced, very bagged out. Um, this is like usually not even closed, just like a like a boost yacht for my feet I've said before the boost on this is insane massive amount of boost uh, standing around on this all day is definitely top choice if you're just like standing you know like say you work I don't know where you work where you stand all day I mean, there's a lot of places like a restaurant it's perfect I don't know if they let you wear these at a restaurant everyone always asks me what's better this or ultra boost it's not about really what's better it's about what you're doing if I'm gonna be walking around all day I still prefer ultra boost as I've said before the way the upper hugs your foot in a prominent ultra boost is amazing this doesn't necessarily hug your foot you kind of just slide into it I know that some of this might not make any sense <laughs> like what are you talking about but really this just feels like a much more shallow fit in the upper. You're not actually like sunk down into it. And then you have this just massive amount of boost. So you're just kind of standing on top of this mountain of 
cloud comfort and it's amazing. Uh, regular EQT sole, nothing crazy. Well, it is actually a little crazy. Um, yeah, and then that's it. So like I said, it does have a mesh inline, but honestly, I wore, I wore these for about an hour, hour and a half maybe, but they are really comfortable. That's what the shoe looks like. Um, and I don't know if I'd say they're a must cop. Like, I think a lot of people are probably gonna pass up on them. Um, one thing that I think is really different about the shoe that I really do actually like, and not that I don't like it on the other shoe, they've removed the striping from the toe, and that just makes for a much cleaner look in this model. Like, it's just different. You know, there's no glitch, it's just solid black. There are things about this shoe that um, I do think are great. Black and white, a little bit of basically Kind of gray, colorway, super clean. And like I said, they are pretty comfortable. I didn't wear them, it's not hot today. Um, I didn't get to wear them like out in the heat, so I don't know if my opinion would change on a hot day if I would think the mesh was a little too sweaty. I don't really know, because it's not hot. I do like them, they're comfortable, I'm keeping them. When I first bought them today, honestly in my head I was like, I'm probably gonna end up selling these, but after wearing them, they're keepers, I'm gonna wear them, I like them, that's it. Peace! <laughs>